Alrighty. Hey guys, how's it going? Jason here, and we are back in Subnautica. That's right, Subnautica. Remember a while back when I got stuck? Well, yeah, I fixed all of that. I took about an hour, an hour and a half to get back everything that I had lost. And um, so here we are back, and I figured we'd do something a little bit not so dangerous, but potentially dangerous, and that is base building. And because we don't have a base, and I need a base so I can become more self-sustaining. Um, so I was thinking maybe parking it close to the Aurora, or maybe off of close to a drop-off. I haven't quite decided yet, but let's take a look. Oh, and it's night. Fabulous. Yay. All right. Um, why are my... S what lights are on? Seamoth. You're draining... Welcome him. aboard, Captain. I just got you back. Let's do a little swimming on our own. I did indeed go back to the island and picked up all the blueprints. I even found some other blueprints. I'm actually kind of happy about those blueprints. I found a battery charger and uh, totally unexpected. Um, still haven't found diamonds for the laser cutter yet. Uh, I'm hoping to find those as soon as possible. I might even spend the time to go do that too. Uh, this is the problem though. I can't see anything. What's this? That's nothing. That's nothing. There's nothing here. Ooh, what are you? Sea glide. Oh! Hey guys! What's going on? Alright. See, I don't want to be close to these guys because those guys drop acid, but they have acid butts. And I need to find a decent spot. 30 seconds of oxygen uh, remaining. Let's head on up. I love this little thing. Though it, it does go a little slow, Ten seconds of oxygen but it keeps remaining. me floating. Or it keeps me getting up there. Alright. Let's take a look what we got here. Now, I kind of like this. It's down here at the bottom. Neighbors might be a little noisy though. Don't really care for that too much. There's also other little things. Oh yeah, those are little bitey things. Ooh, what's that over there? Oh man. Wouldn't it be cool if I could live on the back of those things? Oh, that'd be so weird. Hello? Caution. 30 seconds of oxygen <sighs> remaining. Okay. Oh, that's just creepy. Oh, boy. Okay, so I don't think... I'm pretty close to the Aurora, which means I'm pretty close to Leviathan Town, too. Maybe here. This, would, this wouldn't be too half... This wouldn't be half bad, right? No. I don't think so. Okay. Get over here, fish. Spade fish. And what are you? Oh, an original. Awesome. Because I think I forgot my... Yep. I forgot. Ooh. You know what I need to do? Caution. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. Get some more air. And all right. That's right. Dropping one of these bad boys. Okay, let me let me do this. <laughs> I can't see anything. Caution. 
30 seconds of oxygen remaining. All right. Oh yeah, definitely. All right, guys. So I'm gonna head back to the base, pick up my fabricator, and start building. All right. So I laid out the first platform just a while ago, and now we are back at it. Now I'm wondering if I can actually utilize some of these other platforms for things. That would be kind of cool, though. And I'm gonna go ahead and what I do with that um, well I'll worry about that later let's uh, put down a habitat multi-purpose room right here about right there looks good Whoa! Hey, hey, bitey. It's not cool. That was a nice. And oh, we need. I need glass for a hatch. Okay. Would like to put. Okay, and let's see. Caution, 30 seconds of oxygen okay. remaining. That's pretty good. Not too bad. We got two little spaces. I'm going to put down another, um, another, uh, what do you call them? Multi-purpose rooms. I have enough titanium. I need to get some glass now so I can have a hatch. There we go. So the next thing I'm going to need is I'm going to need some glass. Cleared out most of my titanium. Alright guys, I'll be right back. Okay, so we've ran into a little bit of a problem and that is the ability to power my small home. Apparently, I'm too deep for um, solar power, but I did find a bioreactor schematic uh, a while ago, and I am going to actually... I hope, I hope my base isn't leaking or anything like that. It doesn't look to be. Okay. So, I need to put my... Bioreactor. Yes. Oh, that's going to be interesting. Can I rotate it? How about... No. Okay. Okay, so what this does, it takes... Um... Reliable power source is a crucial step towards self-sufficiency. If you're not already... Oops. Um, what'd that say? A reliable power source... Po power source? Source? Sauce? Power source is a crucial step towards self-sufficiency. If you are not already, consider keeping a photo journal of your achievements to remind you how far you've come since washing up here. So, I need to put biological material 
in here. Now, I think... Now, by biological material, I think they can... They might mean fish, maybe? Maybe not. Let's see. Catch one of these guys. And one of those guys, too. But I probably won't... Okay. Um... Aha! Look at that. And it probably will slowly... Power restored. All primary systems online. Awesome. Um, it will probably slowly eat up... Uh... Yeah, it will probably slowly eat that away. Whoa, whoa. What happened? Oh, okay. I'll probably slowly eat away at that, so I probably need to return back to base. I did find... I did take some... Um... What do you call it? Uh... Some plant matter from the uh, floating island. And while I was there, I also discovered that there was a plant there that actually can... I can use instead of water. It has high water content, which is really awesome. Now, uh, stop... Crashing into my sea moth. Okay. Now, the rotten Chinese plant, I can probably put that into the reactor. And. Okay, making sure I'm going the right way. As long as I don't have the, the lights on, I won't. Um, I won't drain too much power. But uh, let me see if I can get these. I think I can plant the rotten the rotten plants. And I actually do feel a little bit safer here because I know that with those big coral... I forgot what they're called. I need to scan them so I know what they're called. But with those big things there, the leviathans don't come out this way. Welcome aboard, Captain. So I have nothing really to worry about. Let me see. Do I have any doubles? I do. Uh, put that there. That should definitely give me some power. 10 out of 100. Okay. So, let's plant a watermelon. And a Chinese plant. And, uh... Ah. Graphics. Sweet. Chinese potato plant should be... Yep, there it is, right there. It's slowly growing. Alright, let me go pick up the rest of the... The rest of the stuff. This is so cool. Oh, man. I can... Whoa. Okay. I was scared there for a second. Go pick up the rest of this junk and then head on back and pick up a bunch of this titanium because I am going to need a boatload of titanium. The bulba tree, that's exactly what it is. The bulba tree is the is the one am I heading I always gotta double check. I gotta head east. Okay, I can remember that. Uh the bulba tree is the one that is uh, necessary for me. That, that's the replacement for water, basically. At least until I can get a, a water uh, purification system or whatever it's called. be able to plant those later but uh, yep we got ourselves a nice little base I think I'm gonna do a little bit more base construction I'm not gonna do too much exploring I want to keep y'all in the game but uh, hopefully when we come back I will have a much larger and bigger base 
And uh, thanks guys for watching. I do appreciate it. And I will see you all in the next video. Take care, everybody.